the Nathan, Nat and Sean podcast. A lot of people are getting up today to go to work to mm. get money. Yeah. True. Um, and you are making X amount per hour. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know? And then that adds up, goes with your pay, you get tax. That's how life works. Oh, Thanks for Nathan. explaining that. All right. All right, let's <laughs> get the music on. <laughs> <laughs> Is this part of Get School? Is this part of Get School? No, it's a new segment called Nathan States, the obvious. (laughs) (laughs) Well, I'll tell you what, you nailed it. Yeah, that's right. (laughs) Beyonce, she has not performed live for four years. Yeah, right. Wow, four years, that's bizarre. I wouldn't have imagined that. I mean, COVID put a hole in it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know, but it's Beyonce. You expect her to be doing massive world tours and concerts everywhere. Yeah, Coachella and that kind of thing. So Beyonce's um, 41 years old right now, still Mm. looks as young as the day. Oh, yeah, she's amazing. She was in Destiny's Child. Imagine her skin Mm-hmm. Um, she, uh, her first uh, performance mm-hmm. is headlining a show at a, the new Atlantis, the Royal Resort in Dubai. Yes, a lot of oh, people yeah. have rolled over there on the weekend. I saw Nat yeah. Bass on her socials that she was there. Yeah, Rebel and, and Wilson. The, and, went, and the Ribka yeah. twins. And the Ribka twins from <laughs> Perth were invited. <laughs> we had them in well, there hundred times they're over. They're pretty big stars in the scheme of things. That's amazing. I know. Anyway. Mm. So uh, <laughs> she did a one-hour set. I mean, that's a long set, She actually. was generous, though. She yeah. was generous with the time. She gave them 73 minutes. Oh, very nice. 73 so, minutes. Over time. She gave <laughs> so, them 73 so minutes. So what are you thinking? 73 minutes. It's 10 songs. Yep. Or one really long yep. version of Single Ladies. <laughs> I know. Yes. She was paid for her one-hour set, which she gave 73 yes. minutes. Very generous of her. Yes, yes. 35.5 million Australian dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Standing and no one can. else can be Beyonce. She's the only 35. one. 35.5 million Australian dollars. That is so good because she needs it. Yeah, it's oil money. They've mm. got stacks of it. It's amazing, I'd like to it? know because you, you've heard stuff like this over the journey when um, places in Dubai and that have opened big, yeah. big joints and they've just called, you know, like Kylie Minogue and I'm, I'm yeah. not yeah. the biggest names in the world, but they're getting paid. Yeah, Guy Sebastian. Yeah, Sebastian. Sebastian. Just, I'd yeah. love to know that yeah. list yeah. and how many. She, um, uh, so she got put up in the hotel, of course, mm. um, and her room was $143,000 a night as well, so that was just chucked in. Oh, so they didn't charge her for that? No, they didn't charge her for <laughs> that nice. one. They did have to take a bond. So bond <laughs> yeah, we're going to need, yeah, need your credit yeah, card yeah, and take take out $100 off. Yeah, we're going to yeah, take $300 out, and then if the room's okay and we check the mini bar afterwards, you get the $300 back. Uh, okay, I just want to ask, right, can you take anything off the table, right? Mm-hmm. Right? So I could throw anything at you that you would endure for an hour, for thirty five point five million dollars, <laughs> like anything, anything going in you, anything, any, any part. Not do it all. <laughs> <laughs> anything in you, on I mean, you, you in something. Thirty. How much is that? How much is it? Thirty five point five million dollars. I can win my respect back with that. <laughs> <laughs> and even if you don't, just go buy an island. So, yeah, so exactly. you wouldn't mind a combination of something in you, you in something, and then something on you. All of it. And all you of it. something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Live on stage. <laughs> Why not? Why not? <laughs> After, everybody knows you got the coin afterwards. Um, it's a good talking point when you're at a uh, you know a function later on. If there well, are maybe say, any... why are you walking funny? <laughs> well, funny story. If there are any Emirati shakes listening, um, <laughs> Sean's available, everybody. <laughs> it's the Nathan, Matt and Sean podcast. Australia's a very unique place, so sometimes the only way we get an education about something we don't know too much mm. about is through The Simpsons. Oh, Mr Plough, that's my name. name, that name again that is Mr, Mr. Plough. Now, Mr. Plough um, would plough snow. Yes, he would. With a snow plough. Snow plough. Snow plough. Jeremy a, Renner yes, had a snow Yes, it's a foreign world to us. It's not yep. something that we even can contemplate. 14,000 pounds snow plough. So they're pretty heavy. Um, and you would have seen the fact that that poor bugger is in hospital because that snow plough um, went over him. Um, he has now got more than 30 broken bones. 30. And we know that there's a lot of bones in some areas, but I think these are some of the big ones. Yeah. <laughs> I think it, so it ran him over. Six and a half ton. Yeah. Think about that. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. he, he, he did have a lot of... That. It's he, bigger than a hard, yeah. normal harvester. Heavier. Mm. That's a lot. That's a lot. Um, he had a lot of blood loss as well. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Like, yeah. he nearly died. Like, it's, yes. it's amazing that he's still... And there's a long recovery coming yes. back. So, all over his chest and stuff. Yeah, all over so his chest, his leg. a lot of ribs. Um, yeah. yeah, his leg had to be torn okay, so something happened there. Yeah, so right. his femoral artery um, is damaged, apparently. 
that's, oh, and that, that's nasty. That his head just looks like it's been beaten to a pulp. Like yeah. he got, he got, and usually it's a good thing, but he got ploughed. <laughs> oh, that's not good. That's nasty. Man. That's Imagine getting ploughed so hard, your thirty bones break. <laughs> oh, that's a fair effort. Oh, Mister Plough, oh. my name, dead name. You'd be pretty again. proud of yourself if you were the person oh. dishing it out. Ah, <laughs> I'd like, oh, If you're the person that's receiving it, go I'd better drink some milk <laughs> before the next round. Uh, <laughs> I'm wondering how many. Uh, bones somebody has broken at once because you know if you break a leg or you break yes. a finger or one bone you go oh yeah. and then you have to like circumnavigate that injury which yes. usually you can you can hobble around I, I broke three crutches. when I broke my arm remember I broke yes. my arm and then yes. I found out um, later that I'd broken two bones in my hand as well yeah. that was enough I don't want to yeah. break any more yeah. than is that. it your feet or your I'm trying to think. Your face, you can break a heap in your face. Yeah, mate, there's 27 you? in your feet yes. as well. Oh, but yeah. yes, okay, there's, there's, yeah. there's plenty yeah. in your there's face. Bones as in well. your ears. There's bones mm. everywhere. Oh, yeah, but right. you know, like you know, if you've broken your like your your wrist, your leg, um, yeah, several ribs. Yeah, several ribs, and then you have to like just live and like go yes. on about your business. That'd be bad. Well, ribs suck, Sean. You would have broken ribs, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because you can't breathe. You can't, you can't breathe. rest the, them. You can't you know, just put them up. You've got to keep breathing. You know what the worst one about that is? Sneezing with ribs. Yeah. It is the most Coughing painful thing. I was in Bali. I cracked a rib. And, um, oh, we, playing we, football? No, surfing then. <laughs> and um, anyway, we're at this restaurant and I sneezed and screamed <laughs> like, like the biggest... I was going to say girl. I was going to say girl. But that, you know, um, I screamed. It was so funny. Everyone came running, running to me to see yes. what was going on. It was I've embarrassing. I've never broken a bone. That's amazing, considering how brittle you driver. actually are. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Low, I mean, case. Really. Low case on this bad boy. What's go- what's going to fall on you when you're on the couch? <laughs> <laughs> Unless the roof collapses. Like, if, it's if not going to happen. If that TV ever falls over, you're yeah. in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we want to know uh, how many bones you have broken in one sitting. Right. <laughs> yeah. So, how broken you've been at one time? Give us a call thirteen twenty four ten, and someone is going to see something amazing that we got an eyeful of on Friday. Yes, we did. They're going to get um, tickets for them and three mates to see briefs, dirty laundry at Fringe World. Um, check out my Instagram, and you can see what you'll be in for. Uh, Fringe World superstars briefs are back with their new hit show, Dirty Laundry. Don't be jealous. Head to fringeworld.com.au to grab your tickets now. Awesome. Uh, very entertaining show. All right, 13, 24, 10. It's a pretty simple question. How many bones did you break in one go? Jeremy Renner, the Hollywood actor, um, had an incident with his snowplow, as we know. It's been in the news for a little while. Just come out, he's admitted that over 30 bones were broken. We're yep. like, that seems like a lot. Yeah, that is a lot. One, at, is a one lot. at once. One being broken one, is it's sort that's of hard bad. Yeah. Let alone that many. Michael's in South Guildford. Hey, Michael. Good morning, how are you? Oh, we're Good, going, Michael. Oh, Michael. So, did you get busted up? Oh, yeah. Well, um, it's like this. I was uh, unloading steel. I won't say the location. Oh, oh good. And oh, good. as you're unloading the steel, and I was up on the back of the trailer, yeah. the forklift driver turned, and when he turned with the steel, he hit me, which then I fell to the floor of the trailer, landed on a lump of timber, oh, broke yeah. eight ribs on the right broke eight ribs on the right-hand side, fell off the trailer to the ground, landed on my hard hat, and broke seven ribs on the left side. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. So you broke 15. Like, you broke 15 ribs. 15 ribs broken. So there's no ribs, laughing, mate. sneezing or coughing oh, for you. Oh. And, Sean, you was talking about sneezing yeah. and the pain. Yeah. Mate. You sneeze with 15 broken ribs. <laughs> oh, no, I can't. Michael, I, I had a nerve blocker uh, for nine weeks in a row playing footy because I cracked a couple of ribs. Yes. Let alone, how many is that in total? 15. 15. <laughs> so I, I can't even imagine it. What's the reality? Because, you know, we hear that laughing hurts and stuff like that. Did you just, like, watch documentaries and things that, like, and try no, to... No, 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 but there's a better twist to it. Yeah. When I went to the, um, the, the hospital, right, oh, yeah. in the emergency section... They said there's nothing wrong with me. <laughs> oh. It's only, it's only severe bruising. Yes. A week later, I was in that much pain. I was crying in bed and I said to the wife, I can't get up. I can't move. She took me to the doctors, rushed me straight into hospital, and that's when they discovered when they x-rayed me, I had... 15. What can you do with that, Michael? Not much. You just wait it out. Oh, so you're not exactly like, in plaster pain, around the pain chest, relief. are you? Yeah. No, 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 they strapped me up. You don't get blasted. Yeah. Yeah. They yeah. strapped me up. Yeah. And it was like I've never felt anything like it because the bandage was that tight. Yeah. Um, just trying to lay 
laid down Breathe. function as a human yeah. and yeah. walk he doesn't have a good get start. up out of a God. seat and go no to the toilet. St- yeah. It was just so grateful. It was unbelievable. Oh, my God. And but, yeah, no. well, anyway, that's my little story. Yeah. Oh, oh, no, no, that was a really good, good, good one, Mike. Really good little story. And he made to make sure he didn't laugh during that period, yeah, so right. listening to us was fine. Yes, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> danger. That's safe from six till nine. Thanks, Michael. Chris, hello. Yeah, guys, how are you? Good, Chris. Oh, Chris, what happened to you? How many bones? Uh, I think it was about seven. When I was 14, I got cleaned out by a car in North Frio, crossing the road. Oh. And um, I was, uh, we were in North Frio, and uh, I don't know if you guys remember, remember, this is going back about 30 years ago, but um, it used to be Ed's Deli down there. I think it's now the Truffle House or something. Oh, we don't, we're, oh, only, we're, only, we're, many, we're yeah. only like 32 years You're old, talking... so we wouldn't retain that <laughs> yeah, memory. Yeah, the Truffle House. Uh, no, it's next truffle. to the bottle shop. Black Truffle next is what you're shop. talking about. Yes, it's um, yeah, on yeah. Sterling Highway, yeah. Yeah, yeah, well, um, I had an argument with my nan who was, who was dropping me and my cousin off uh, <laughs> earlier on that day. I said, oh, can you drop us off at the train station because I don't want to cross the highway? Oh, no, no, you'll be right, you'll be right, you'll be right. So, all right, <laughs> jump the highway. Ten minutes later, she gets a phone call from my cousin and kids, uh, Chris has been ran over. And fortunately, there was a fire, fire engine that came down the highway literally just after it happened and he blocked the highway. And what happened was there was one car at the traffic lights and the lights were red. And, you know, as you go across the dual traffic carriageway and there's then the green light turns green for the car and he starts to move. And so your natural reaction is just to hop forward. And the car was slowing down for for the red light, then it's turned green and taken off again. So I had to hop forward. I've hopped straight into its path with a surfboard under my arm. And the car hit my surfboard. Snapped my arm like a twig. Oh, the back of the board shot me under the board, under the car, and not right under, under the, the car, car, but the, yeah. not well. It, yes. it it ran across both feet, oh. broke my left leg, and broke my right ankle. How many bones in the end? Uh, tib fib. Um, both uh, my left arm in the middle was facing was ninety degrees facing oh. straight up. Oh, good for break dancing. Oh. It was. Well, I'm forty five years old now, so I think it was about. Yeah. Jeez. There were three in I my there were big ones too, yeah. Yeah, I was in a wheelchair. It was right at the start of the of the, of the uh, Christmas holidays too. <laughs> oh, Chris. <laughs> yeah, I was ill. And, and by the time I got back to school, I was still in a wheelchair, but I had half cast on both arms. Yeah. And I had one... <laughs> And I had half cast on both legs, so I could still sort of scoop myself around. Yeah. <laughs> but I imagine but, that was uh, probably a bum wiping issue for you there. Oh, did someone have to wipe oh, your bum? Oh, there was Chris. at the start. Who wiped mum your bum? Good. Your mum wiped your bum. Oh, Chris. When you're like that, no, everything goes care. out the window. <laughs> yeah, you don't care. I don't know. I don't know, Chris. I don't know if I could ever recover from it. I think I'd rather just, you know what, keep the bones broken. Like, <laughs> I, I, let's not do this. Um, uh, all right, thank you, Chris. That sounds grim. Yep. And Grandma was wrong, so that's also, yep. you know, something. All right, 13, 24, yeah. 10. We are going to take more of these. We want to know how many bones you broke at one time. We're discussing how many bones you might have broken at one time, obviously inspired by Jeremy Renner, yep. Hollywood actor yep. who's busted more than 30 in a snowplough accident. Which makes sense because he plays Hawkeye in the Avengers and um, birds have hollow bones, so they would have broken sure. very, very easily. Oh, well, wow. it's a good point, Nath. Thank you. I guess I'll learn from you. <laughs> Kane's in Allenbrook. Hi, Kane. Hi, how you doing? Yeah, good, Kane. Um, how many bones at once, Kane? So I broke three in my face and oh. four teeth at the same time. Oh, face bones. <laughs> oh, jeez. Kane, how did that happen, mate? So I was on my way to work on a motorbike and the car in front of me basically had put the brakes on pretty quickly mm. and I went through the rear window of an SUV. Oh. Oh, oh so... Broke through it. Yeah, so basically my head and up to my shoulders basically went into their car. Oh, <laughs> that's an awkward conversation. Oh, okay. It is. What do you say then when they you go? Oh, sorry, you go Hel- hello, hello. Or, um, oh, you stopped suddenly. Oh, oh thank God, <laughs> there's a box of tissues in the back here. <laughs> I would imagine it would have been pretty shocked to say the least. Yeah. Oh, yeah. you're not wrong, Kane. Have, did you get cut up really badly as well? Um, I bit through my lip. Uh, I've got a scar on my chin and then on my shoulder as well. Okay, oh, <laughs> so um, broken face bones, what were they? Do they have names? So, uh, I don't know the names. Just above where, like, your top teeth are, like the bone that runs across there, because I shattered three teeth at the top. So that's yes. one maxilla. Back. Yeah. Yep. And then where your jaw connects, it was about a centimetre of bone that kind of just went wherever oh, it jaw went. Jaw connects, yes. Mandible. So, yeah, so I had... Um, 
I had a, basically, it wasn't connected for about a week, um, and then I was drinking through a syringe for three. <laughs> you, sorry, you were drinking. Uh, you were drinking through a syringe. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. And then after that, his mother was chewing up her food and spinning it yes. to his mouth like oh, a bird. Regurgitating. <laughs> okay. Well, that's a day. That's so grim. yeah, I went, when I went back to work after three weeks, I'd lost about fifteen kilos. And one of, the ladies, <laughs> one of the ladies at work said to me, "Oh, you're looking really good. What's your diet?" And so I pulled the syringe out and showed her. Yeah. Uh, there you go. I mean, so my face. last night I had a syringe full of roast. Um, yes. That was delicious. <laughs> Oh, you just off for the gravy, wouldn't yeah. you? Tonight I'm having, getting yeah, a little much? bit crazy. I'm going to treat myself. It's a syringe full of Zinger Burger. It's going to be delicious. You know how much water you've got to add to scrambled eggs to actually make it liquid enough? <laughs> it's a question I hope I never have to answer, Kane. But thank you. That's amazing. Thanks for the calls. Michael, Chris yeah. and Kane are all in the running for To Live Free for 23. Um, Kane, you've come over the top Kane. here. You're going to walk away with tickets for you and three mates to see Brief Sturdy Laundry at Fringe World. Oh, you'll love it. It's a there great show, go. Kane. There you go. That. No worries. Nice work. Don't break your face, Stay mate. Because there's things come flying at you in that show. <laughs> that's, that's <laughs> Got to be have your wits about you. Nathan, Nat, and Sean podcast. Out of twenty first on Friday night. Um, Are you a bit old for that? <laughs> so young. No, I'm at that yeah. age where uh, yeah. my my son's friends are all 21, Correct. and I'm that parent who's getting invited along. Yeah, they're called tallies. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I was called that before. <laughs> so um, when I got, I'd, I've been out and about all day. So when I got home, um, uh, hang on, let's oh, talk about what out and about means. You were on a boat at Rottnest for the full day after doing our Fringe World OB in the morning. You went yeah, straight I came to Rottnest. I came in hot. I came <laughs> yeah. in and really then again, hot. he did have energy up his sleeve because he only worked three days last That's week. That's true. <laughs> He was out and about. He wasn't doing errands. He was on a boat at Anyway, Rotary. when I came in, um, uh, everyone was ready to go other than me, so I needed to get changed because uh, there was a theme. It was Wolf of Wall Street oh, yeah. and so, everyone was wearing pants yeah, and shit. So you just went yeah. as a pile of cocaine, did yeah. you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, when we got, so when I got home, my son, um, Lachlan, he had borrowed a pair of my pants and Megan had bought these pants for me and she was giving him a hard time because since he's been back from Europe, he hadn't been to the gym for a couple of months, and she reckons he's lost his ass. He's got oh, no okay, he hasn't been doing his squats. He's got no bum to fill out the pants. Ah. Oh. Anyway, we turn up to the uh, 21st, and everything's going along pretty good, and then my wife, Megan, she's ha- having a chat to Lachlan's girlfriend, saying, oh, look at Lockie over there, look at his ass. he's lost it, all this kind of oh, stuff. So she goes... He's lost it, it's just slid down the back of his leg. <laughs> yeah. So she goes up to him or what she thought was him at the bar. The girlfriend or or Megan. Megan goes up to this guy wearing the same trousers as what I had and uh, she's just grabbing grabbing the the guy's bum. And obviously... The guy being her son. Yes. And she's going, Oh, no bum, no! I would think that's an inappropriate thing for a mother to be doing, don't you? She thought she was so funny. (laughs) Sorry, Sean sort of told us this story earlier on this morning. I thought you meant the girlfriend. Me too. Bum. 100%. Megan. Didn't know it's Megan. <laughs> no, that's just, both of us have looked at each other like, he's telling it wrong. No, he's not. No, I'm not. He <laughs> told it wrong this morning. That's right. <laughs> so it, wasn't, it wasn't the girlfriend. You said the no. girlfriend went up and drank his ass. Oh, well, no. Was, no. Uh, his Lock, mother. Megan was like, to Megan. Lockwood. His Megan mother. is doing it to her son. So anyway. then, that's okay. So that's okay. Lachlan, well, what she thought was Lachlan turned around. It was another bloke. Oh, it was another. Kid. It was another young child. <laughs> <laughs> so um, when's your wife been in prison? Is that what we're doing? They've been twenty four ten. So she was thought it was the funniest thing ever. Wrong uh, that she got the wrong identity. I'm yeah. starting to think she might have been doing it on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, <laughs> filling up a twenty one year old. So wonder she didn't recognise your pants or her son. Yeah. Interesting. Can I, you know what? It's very dangerous because um, some people, like, you know, especially from behind, you yes. know, it's very easy to mistake people from behind. I've talked about it. My, my dad now has, has reached the stage where there are Brian's everywhere. That's true. Um, he does have, have, have a very common face. Literally, like, his, um, it, his hair, the way he walks, he wears a hat, his clothes. There is a there is an army of Brian's out there. So I literally what sometimes... What a disturbing thought, yes, by the way. So sometimes <laughs> I have to really check myself because I'll see dad at my local shops yes, and I'm and like, you're and, touching uh, his bum. And, I, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you can, I, I can never walk up and say, oh, hey, Dad, because I know it's probably not him. There's, there's a thousand of him issued yes. around. So. And so he's really offended that you don't say hello to him in yeah. public. <laughs> but there are, seriously, there are Brian's everywhere. You've probably Beware. seen one. I've, I drove through, I remember over the break, I drove through, I drove past three of them yeah. on the way to Dad's house. Well, well, we all know the legend <laughs> of the drop Brian, I drove where they drop three, three trees. Yes, <laughs> three Brian's to get to a Brian. It was unbelievable. <laughs> uh, we well, want to know when you um, have uh, mm. gotten 
the identity to someone. Um, yeah, uh, horribly wrong. Yeah, horribly wrong. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and sometimes this can really happen from behind. Mm. Yeah, yeah. You can. yeah. Um, we're going to give somebody. Uh, no, nothing actually. We're going to give somebody a chance to win. Uh, Live and free for twenty three. That's yes, right. Everybody will. that gets on air with us, but we want to hear good stories. Please thirteen twenty four ten. Did you get somebody's identity horribly wrong? We are discussing when uh, there's a bit of a. Mistaken identity. Yep. Maybe yep. you've accidentally fondled the wrong person, like mm. Megan, thinking she was fondling her son, yeah, it's fine. which is bad enough, <laughs> but she was actually fondling a stranger. Mm. Uh, hello, Lisa. <laughs> Hi, guys. How are you going Good, today? Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Is this um, about the wrong person or are we getting a fondling story? Mate, you're getting a fondling Great. story, you know? Great. Love it. Seems what we're so after. Take it away. My partner and I, we were at the Leopold Hotel <laughs> down in Frio there, yeah. listening to Mental as Anything. <laughs> Amazing. You know, singing, singing one of my favourite songs, The Nips Are Getting Bigger. So my partner and I are standing at the bar and I start rubbing up against him, bopping away, you know, singing my heart out. Yeah. Next thing you know, I see him walking towards me. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> so who was the rando the that you were gyrating against? I have no idea, mm. but he looked at me as if I was this crazy old lady. No. Mm. Oh, that was, was it thought... Sean McManus, yeah, perchance, I'm, because I'm he's often at the Leopold? Yeah, particularly on a Friday. Oh, my no. favourite thing is, so you are grinding up against a stranger, and that yes. stranger is just letting it happen. <laughs> 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 that's oh, right. That's that was they turn around and go, right. I think you've got the wrong, wrong person. person. <laughs> I did have the wrong person, but the thing was, my partner just saw the funny side of it. He was just laughing at me. Yeah, well, okay, well it is good. funny. That's, that's good. So wrong. At least he's not the jealous type. No, no, he's <laughs> not at all. Not upside. at all. Good oh. old Loza. He mm. wouldn't be jealous of anyone. No, that's beautiful. <laughs> Thanks, Lise. Bianca, hello. Hi. Hi, Hi Bianca. Bianca. What happened? Uh, so my partner, who I thought was my partner, was in the kitchen, uh, head down on the phone, and I just kind of walked up to him. You know, moved my hand around and then heard this, oh, noise. And it uh, turns out it was not my partner after all. It was his housemate. Oh, <laughs> where, did, where, did, where, did your hands, where did your hands move exactly? Around to the front. Around the front. Around the front, around the front yeah. yeah. Just yeah. to adjust the package for <laughs> a second. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. There was a bit I of think, action in the front section. No, no. My favourite thing is yeah. if, he said, if he also said nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, well, luckily for me, he was alarmed. So. Okay, yeah. so he was alarmed and then you realised it's not your partner. Um, uh, what, what happens, happens next? next? <laughs> I was also alarmed. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, honestly, just same as last call. I just saw the funny side of yeah. it as well. Great. Do you go over? Do you I then lo- just walk over to the sink and wash your hands? What happens? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. I just ran back into the bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> you can't be too careful, everybody. Please. <laughs> just be oh. careful. <laughs> Thank you. you. The tail so far. Right, let's finish up with Demi. Hi, Demi. Hi, how are you? Hey, good, Demi. Right, Demi, what happened? Good. So years ago, I don't know if you remember the time that the rugby player, Hopawaki, the... Yes. Yep. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, sort of got caught doing things on the, on the field. field. <laughs> another with another player that he should have. Fingers up, um, bums, yeah? Yes. Got ya. <laughs> yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah that <laughs> one. The only, um, the only sports story I remember. <laughs> 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 yeah, keep going. <laughs> Well, we were on, I was on Cayman Island with my ex and we at the breakfast buffet. Well, he was. I was already sitting down, but she didn't realise. Um, and he was standing next to another girl, obviously, that looked like me. And he just grabbed <laughs> grabbed her on the backside and just said, off a white tea. <laughs> he said <laughs> to a stranger. To a stranger. <laughs> and it to a total stranger at the breakfast buffet. <laughs> She's obviously just turned around and just got, was absolutely horrified. Apparently, I didn't see it. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> a, he, <laughs> so he grabbed her on the. I mean, he didn't okay. fully go in. Okay, Nathan, oh but my it was God. more the suggestion Sorry. that he was going. Okay, to. great. I just yes. thought I thought he oh, stuck yes. his finger up someone's <laughs> <No>. bum. It's <laughs> more well, threatened to while his hand he, was on it. <laughs> he didn't. He didn't actually um, describe exactly what he did, but I hope not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Similarly, she was wearing pants at How the time. How did she go that, yes. with that? <laughs> Oh. And then he, he came back. He came back to the table. I'm happily sitting there eating my breakfast, <laughs> and he just he was just white. He just looked at me and was like, "Oh, oh, the worst thing just happened." <laughs> oh, yeah, that's pretty bad. <laughs> Like, cause technically, back, technically, back she could press charges. Of course you know she I mean? could. Like, oh, yeah. Because people, and when you hear the explanation, it's yes. like, oh, yeah, yeah okay, yeah, we yeah, get yeah, it. Yeah. But we're but living in the day and age now. I where know. 
Can't go sick. Hop a No, don't hop a anybody, just to be safe. <laughs> Nathan, Nat and Sean is a Nova podcast. For more great comedy shows like this, head to novapodcasts.com.au. Nova.